Hi everyone. In this tutorial, we are going to load a data from a REST API. I have a RESTful endpoint which returns the JSON data, and I have INIC2 instance running with a side menu template. To load the data, I am going to create a provider using the command INIC generate provider and then the provider name. You have to run this command in the root of the directory. This is the root of the project directory and on running this command you will find a folder as provider which contains the REST service TypeScript file. You can find the directory under the source directory. And I have a method call it as load to fetch the data from the RESTful API. I have a variable as data with the type any. I have to include the request options and the header. I have imported the request options and headers at the angular http and inside the method I have checked for the data if it already exists I have written the promise else I have set the headers as application data and the content type and these are wrapped ins inside request options and I have used the get method to receive the data you are done with this in your page you can call this service I am going to import the service this is the class from providers and then the service once you are done with importing you have to include inside components and then you have to inject it inside the constructor as a public I am going to call the load method inside the class rest service rest service dot load and in the promise I am receiving the data written by load method in the variable data. I am going to print this data. I am going to save this TypeScript file. It's building. You can see the REST URL in the network tab and the response written by the API. You can visit the page once more. The call has been made and the data has been written. Now I am going to print this data in the HTML for that. 
I have a public variable as press data and using assigning the data return to the rest data and in HTML I have written the simple logic using ng4 to print the title and the body which was in the JSON field yes the data has been printed here successfully if you like this video please subscribe